Hey, 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 y'all. What is happening, my lovely angels? Welcome to my channel, T-Girl Magic Hero. Yeah, yeah. Here to do a reading for my ch ch gemini my lovely Gemini. And my collective, what is going on, everybody? How are you feeling? How are you living? What you doing? I hope everybody's doing well, as always. And always will remaining sending love, light, and healing energy to all y'all. Everybody. Okay? Because what the world needs now is love. Sweet love. And that's the highest vibration. So just thank you for being here. Thank you for, you know, taking your time out to be with me. Us as a family. Okay? Thank you for being a subscriber. If you're not, I would like to have you as one. We want you part of the family. Okay, as I ask you come in, please hit a thumbs up to let me know that you energetically connect with the video, that you like the video. It helps me tap into the energies more as well. So it's an energetic donation as well as uh, me getting to tap into the energy of the collective. That's why we're here, to learn, heal, grow, and evolve to be better than we did 10 seconds ago. Dang it, okay? Are we perfect? Absolutely not. But we don't want to remain in that same, in that you know, negative state. We all come in low vibration, but we want to raise the raise the bar, raise the standards, you know, to become one and step into our divinity with our Heavenly Father so we can live our life more abundantly. We're going through a school. I don't know why I'm going off on this because there's lessons. Mercury, something about lessons now. Something, somebody's about to come back from the past and reach around the corner and hit the block again, spin that block. And But I don't know, an air sign? Air sign, they're coming to you or you're coming to an air sign or I don't know. But anyway, let's get into the, you know, because I feel this is, needs to be raised the vibration. This needs to be raised the vibration. <laughs> this reading, we're going to have to raise the vibrations on this, okay? Because we have to see past the illusions because someone's coming in all extra and we need to figure it out. So choir, come to the front <clears throat> on always take, like it's not going to resonate with everybody. Did I say that part? So you want to know your life better. But it's fluid, so you can slip, switch it and flip it, male or female, whatever. Um, and thank you again for your love and support. So, um, one, two, three, oh, T-Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective. T-Girl, 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 Magic and Collective. T-Girl, Tarot, Magic and Collective. Check us out and see what we're about, about, about. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we sing Gemini, 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 we are Gemini, 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 my Gemini. Yay! Okay, we sing the song to raise the vibes because that's what the Heavenly Father gave. So there's special keys and notes in that song. That it does its job. So, anywho, I'm getting the energy that there is an air sign. There's a lesson to be learned. Somebody's about to turn the corner again. Turn around. Every time I get, since somebody get hungry, I don't know, somebody's hungry for you. They're trying to cause some type of illusion. Neptune. That's illusions cover up something. The air sign's trying to cover up something and spin the block. I don't know, they say they, it didn't happen like that or. It wasn't like that, or I didn't mean it like that. Something that an air sign didn't mean like that. Cancer, okay, Gemini, okay. So this could be this Gemini Cancer Cusper, for real. Or this could be your Emperor, who's in Mars energy, so they're very angry right now. So that's dangerous. Somebody's going to come off all loving and caring with this Cancer energy, but they're two-faced. Duality, Gemini, this is your energy. There's a... This is an air sign on air sign crime. Don't have to be. They can be any zodiac sign. However, there's somebody, I don't know, something about a Gemini and an Aries energy. Somebody's trying to cause an illusion, a Neptune. So there, and I'm also getting, I'm getting two different. So there's two separate couples or two separate, I don't know. I guess they're couples even if you're not with this person, okay? I'm just going to say the couples for whatever purposes the first energy that i'm getting okay there is a gemini and there's another air sign or this gemini is trying to cause some type of illusion they want to spin the block again 
They're trying to cause an illusion, okay, of Mercury retrograde. So this is something that you're supposed to learn a lesson from. And this is an emperor energy, an Aries, okay? Ooh, yeah. Who's on fire, child, and they mad about it. Don't say it's coming through these cards too, spirit. Yeah, it's a lesson. They're, they're, they're coming to you for some type of stability because Jupiter has to do with your fortune, your luck, your sudden wealth. But there's been a turn of events, with this 9 as being some type of change. With this 18. 18 could be significant. Scorpio. There's an ending to someone's fortune or someone's wealth. With this Gemini energy. Okay. This air sign energy. They're extremely in their emotions. Okay. I heard bitter. Bitter Betty. Okay. So if, whether this be a male or a female. They're bitter Betty about something. And they are two-faced. They have some type of duality. I don't know if you go back and forth with this person. But something is ended. You could be a Scorpio or have that heavily aspected in your chart. But you see through, th through something. You put an ending because Scorpio is the death card. Scorpio is you put an ending to illusions because you see something with this sun card. Okay? Yeah, that this person is not fruitful. The ground is not good. So this could be a bad seed. Yeah, Taurus, you plow certain things. You're unable to plow the seed in this type of energy or this type of dirt. The dirt needs nourishment, but it doesn't have any nourishment. Okay, but you see something about this air sign or whoever this person is. Gemini, you see it. There's an ending to something. And um, somebody's very upset. They're on fire. They're pissed off. They're upset. So did, 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 somebody, did something or someone end something with an Aries? Because it looks like... I don't know who's mad. It could be both. I don't know. There's two people involved. Oh, Lord have mercy. That's what I'm picking up. Two people. If it's not two couples, it's two people. Two male energies. They're masculine energies. And they're, they're, they're one man, man is in his energy. Aries energy is the emperor energy. This emperor's on fire. Child, don't, like I said, I did a reading about an Aries energy, emperor energy, who was involved with some type or married to an earth sign could be a taurus capricorn or a virgo they are honey this land or this ground or the 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 the, the rep reproduction i can't even get it out the reproduction area is not fertile okay with this capricorn energy maybe there or this earth sign energy they did something for money or somebody did something for some money but it didn't grow but anyways, this emperor's on fire. Either he's pissed off about being on fire or angry or he's just mad as hell. But there's some type of burning sensation that's going on with this fucking Aries from the waist down. Oh, my God. Oh, look at the man. Something is swollen. Look. I didn't even see that until now. You see this? Something's wrong. with. And then the other readings we've been having, swollen genitalia. Something, this Aries is on fire. Child, I don't, fear. what is the point of just knowing this? Fear, what is happening? Because somebody, okay, so because somebody want to come back. Okay, Gemini, I don't know what the hell is happening here. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Searching for answers, I do not know nothing. Somebody wants to, who wants to come to Gemini? Who is this? Angels, who wants to come towards Gemini? Hi, hi, cross watcher, or this is you, Gemini. Who is who, 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 who? Because something's ended. Something has been illuminated to something about an air sign or an air sign has ended something. The secret, some, something was revealed with the moon in reverse. What was revealed about this earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, or Vir a Taurus? And something about a Libra and a Taurus. Okay, this Libra could be a psychic. This Capricorn could be psychic. Something about a love triangle or a love quarrel. Now there's a masculine fire sign energy that's cold towards this earth sign. Yeah, because he's pissed off at her or him. Because they cause some type of illusion. Aquarius is like this Neptune energy illusion. It's, you hear that revving in the background, honey? Yeah, somebody all in their emotions. So I don't know. There's a broken, there's a broken hearted, wounded couple, but... What is Gemini high vibe? Gemini, this could be you. You could have got caught up in something. You could be receiving karma. 
Now, this is definitely not my beautiful high vibe angels now, baby. This ain't you. Yeah. Somebody's being forced to look at something from a different perspective about... What are they being forced to look at it from a different perspective, spirit? They being... Child, that they should... They're toxic ways. Something about this Capricorn child. Look! That they should have laid something to rest with this toxic energy or they should have put to rest their toxic ways, this toxic addiction, this toxic affliction... And I'm feeling that this is this Aries energy who's pissed. I feel that these two masculine women... Ooh, I said two masculine women. Two masculine women. I meant something. Maybe somebody is trans, you know, gender. You know, it is what it is. Two masculine women. So maybe this one of the masculines, that's what they were into. It is what it is. And somebody discovered that or it was revealed. An air sign is into that. Okay. Oof, okay. I mean, hey, hey, it's 2024 now. Yeah, Gemini, somebody is the, you expo the secret is out about you being into whatever you're into, or you're being with an earth sign or whatever, this air sign, child. You're trying to be with somebody for money, but the person who you went to, this earth sign, they didn't have no money. That was an illusion, or I don't know, but there is. A, Something's been revealed and it's a big deal. And it's left somebody all in their emotions. And they ended something with somebody. They did. Because they feel like they deserve love. Whoever this they are. So what is this, Spirit? Tell me what the hell is this? Because somebody, Gemini, this is your energy. The Nine of Swords. Gemini, are you in the Nine of Swords over something? What is you in the Nine of Swords over? Or this could be this emperor, you know, that's in his emotions and he's in regret. Because somebody got, I mean, spirit, I hate to put it like that. But somebody, shall they getting karma for being a traveling hoe? They want, they thought they were traveling to get some type of good news. But you see how this, this, this page is looking at this wand like something's wrong. Something's, something's wrong with me wand, honey. And they have to think about, so now somebody's looking at threesomes in a different way or... They're trying to use their intuition. I don't know. It's just like they're trying to figure out who gave them something because they didn't use their intuition when their intuition was telling them not to go to that party or be with those people or put it, go in that, go. I'm getting it. Somebody likes polygamy. They like a lot of people when they have their activities, you know, when they have their intimate activities. They like different bodies and, and sessions and people. But now somebody is like all in their emotions and they're in regret. Spirit, why is this person in regret? I'm confused. So it could be that somebody was into threesomes or being very promiscuous, having a lot of lovers. Somebody gave somebody a chance. And, and now, yeah, they reconciled with somebody. Whoever this inner, just toxic energy is, they reconciled with that person or that energy. And then what happened after that, Holy Spirit, after they done reconciled? The Spirit said, I think you should get the tea for this. Oh, my God. So after they reconciled with the Holy Spirit, they reconciled. And then somebody had a one-night stand after the fact that they reconciled with this emperor energy, honey. Yeah, that's what it, ooh, what, that's what it was. And this em, so this emperor, they had a night of passion, and they got burnt. And they somebody's in regret. Because there's an ending with somebody's two of cups. Now somebody's blocking somebody and don't want nobody back. So let me just say, divine feminine or masculine, there could be an ex of yours that left you. Okay, they went to go to whatever they went to go to. I don't know, in the streets somewhere. <clears throat> because they want to be, I don't know, I'm just getting a lot of promiscuous, a lot of activity, fiery, passion, bodies, you know, all that extra um, they're doing all this in secret, but somebody's upset because some type of secret has been revealed, though, too, about a toxic lover or a toxic something or something about being put to rest or unaliving some, something. Mm. They, okay, this two of cups got put to rest. So I guess the relationship with you, you're the two of cups. The two of cups ended by a passionate uh, one night stand because this person was being flighty and noncommittal. They wanted something or someone else. They thought they were sneaking away, getting 
away with something, but they weren't. Because it came out at the end anyway. Because whoever, oh yeah, honey, because it came out at the end anyway. Okay, because the Gemini got sick. Oh, damn, Gemini and Emperor. Okay, so there, I don't know if there's two men that got sick. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Child, there could have been two men that got sick. Okay, same sex. I don't know, maybe because that's they were dealing with it and somebody was married. See, that's why y'all need to stop... Oh, having a free, you can do whatever, but I'm just saying these, this advice would help, you know, break down and eliminate some of this confusion and toxicity. If you would just stop to think, let, let the light come on upstairs. Is anybody home? Hello? Hello? People are just taking action in any way, any form, not committing, just moving this wands and the sticks everywhere. And now somebody stressed the hell out because something came out about an air sign or about a cancer or about a Virgo or something, honey. And now somebody's devastated now. Yeah, Queen of Wands is devastated because somebody got called out. <clears throat> Queen of Wands is the other woman. It could be somebody very confident, very sexy. But why did the Queen of Wands, yeah, she getting called out. The Queen of Wands is getting called out. They're under judgment. And somebody stressed out about this Queen of Wands being under judgment because somebody done walked away. So this Queen of Wands, it could be the Emperor's wife, this Aries wife. It could be this Gemini. Somebody saw something. They realized something. Somebody ended up getting sick. They got called out. Or you could have called this person out. I don't know. Somebody called somebody out on their stuff. Or they got a phone call from the hospital, child? What? And when they got that call from the hospital, they decided to walk away? Or somebody tried to avoid a call from the hospital? Or somebody doesn't believe the call that they got from the hospital, but they're in their head about it because they know something's over? Child, what is going on? Because somebody's walking back to a Two of Cups energy, which I feel this Two of Cups. They want to come in and rush in and get with you, Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher. Child, because they, this is what I'm getting. Because they either want another cycle with you, they want to rebirth with you, or they want to end things with you. I mean, they just want to end it because they, they just want to end something, but you're blocking this person. Okay, you're blocking this person because, and they're all in their head because they're like, well, why are you blocking me? Because you usually show up as the Queen of Cups. Like energy, male or female, you shoot, you usually really open arms, forgiving, loving, caring, nurturing. You make this person feel good, like, oh, baby, it's going to be all right. Yeah, you big mama here, big mama here. <laughs> but not this time. You blocking them out. You're like, oh, hell no, and you walking away. Gemini, you walked away already. But this person, now they want to come back. Why are they trying to come back again, Spirit? Because this is confusing to me. Because what? Because they really feel like they want a second chance and they want to express their love to you. That's what they say. They want to express their love to you and they got a lot of chemistry. So this person is very attracted to you. They do feel like you're a soulmate and they would love for you to keep an open mind about it. But you're blocking them and walking away. Okay, I don't see nothing wrong with that because their person's stuck. They're waiting on you or they're, I don't know, something about them being stuck is, yeah, they want to travel to you to spill their emotions or they their baggage or trauma bond with you. That's what I'm getting. And they want, after they trauma bond with you, this is their plan. Then they want to propose to you, talk about you're, you're my wish fulfillment, you're my everything because they think that they're going to emotionally pull and tug on your heartstrings. Because this person's afraid, deathly, that they done cause some type of disruption, some type of war, some type of something that cannot be fixed. This person is in this energy as well because they are the ones with this swollen gen. I don't know what the hell. They done did some shit. They done got this child. They got a bump. Child. Ooh. I did not see it like what? Oh, my God. How long has this been like this? This person, or they could just have a massive, you know, they could be King, you know, King Kong heavy. 
Okay? You maybe, but so, honey, something is on this child. It's right near. I'm going to tell you exactly where to look. If, if you're saying you ain't going near that, you ain't going to see. But I, I'm going to tell you, it's right, right in the middle. Right, literally, it's right there, baby. This person could be skinny. Something's wrong. They have some type of abnormal size genital, honey. Oh my God. I don't know why I was so fixated on that because I am surprised. I'm just like, what? This Aries is pissed off because he done got something, child. This earth sign in the reverse. The devil's in the reverse, child. The illusions is over. Somebody, somebody could have snapped though, too. Because they, they feel, they feel, they feel this king, who this Aries energy or whoever this water sign is or air sign, they feel devastated and violated. To the point where they could have got so angry with whoever this earth sign energy is. They could have got, you know, because this earth sign is now blocking them for an air, an air, I mean a fire sign. Because, yeah, the, this fucking Capricorn is blocking this Gemini air sign energy. For this fire sign, but this fire sign don't give a damn though still because him light, him burnt. I don't know, him swollen or burnt or child. Oh my god, this is horrible. Mm-hmm. This Aries, this is this Aries. Mm-hmm. I really my mind is just oh my god. And they don't know what to do. Look. They don't know what to do about this Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Virgo, Earth sign energy. They don't know what to do. They, they Because they didn't use their intuition. This is the intuition telling them what they wanted to do. This is the type of like, I don't know, I don't know what to do. I'm so confused. But you know what the hell you need to do. You just choose it not to. You choose it to be blind and not see. But your intuition is telling you exactly what you need to do. Cut this person or block this person out. But they didn't block that person or cut that person out because they were lusting. Okay, they wanted something because the spirit was also telling this person to block this person out because they could have been carrying some type of illness. They could have been a carrier of something. This poor air, uh, this poor emperor was married to whoever this person was, this air, earth sign was. Oh yeah, they feel some kind of what this. This is Aries energy. The fool. They feel foolish because even his guides were telling him. Or maybe he didn't want to listen to him. The little Fido in the back. Maybe this person has a white little, you know, Yorkie poodle. But honey, yeah, now they waiting for something. What they waiting for, spirit? They waiting for an ending? They waiting for an ending to be to leave somebody out in the cold? To take action towards a new beginning with... I know they not. That's a uh-uh. No, they not. Child, this is these are the signs of those types of times. Like y'all, if these are some not these are unhealed energies. Somebody want to come and take a leap of faith with you. I hope it ain't one of these energies, child. They all toe up. Yeah, they want to come take a leap of faith, baby. Look at them. Look at them. King of Swords or Gemini. This is you, or you want? They want to take a leap of faith towards you, or they want to balance out things with you. But you're on another pathway. Your pathway in election is sure. You're with the sun. You follow the sun, which is God. You have a lot of knowledge. You're an alchemist. You balance out certain things. This person needs you in their energy so that you can balance them out in some form. And they want to make some type of apology. But this is this is a heavy burden to this person. Yeah, because it looks like you're moving away. And this, I don't know why I heard him so much. Cause this, because, yeah, because if they were to use their intuition... If they only had a heart like the Tin Man and the Wizard of Oz, they would have, you know, been able to move to calmer waters with you. But it looks like because your calling and your election is sure, and they had the chance to get the calling and election sure, but they didn't. They missed the bus. They can catch another bus, but you're going to be on a whole nother bus going somewhere else. So that part is like, okay, but God, you know, you know, he gives other chances, but it's just spirits say, mm-mm. I'm so mad. Spirit Spirit says it's not that easy, okay? Yeah, they have to have faith to do to do what they need to do and to take the next steps and leap of faith in their life. They need to have faith like you have faith. You're obedient and you listen to the calling. That's what you do. 
So this person is worried because something was exposed on a platform, on some speakers, on a radio wave. Somebody heard something and got this Aries or this Emperor pissed off, honey. Yeah, because he like, what you fucking, what? He's, cut. oh my God, whoever this Queen of Cups is, this, this Aries, mm, he is not being nice to this lady. She ain't in reverse right now, but... They fussing and fighting and stuff. I hope they, I hope a fight didn't break out. A fight could have broke out now because somebody got burnt now. Somebody got a disease, child, because somebody was causing an illusion to the marriage. They're upset because this whole thing, this whole marriage, you mean this whole relationship was an illusion? You lied to me? You was out here being a hoe trying to act like you, the bomb.com, just because this person looked good. So this person, this emperor could have been under under some type of love spell, some incubus, sex energy, illusion spell. They were able to sneak away and get away with lies. They keep something hidden by using their body. Oh, wow. Yeah, their body, Adi. Their, their wand, their, their, their middle parts or whatever. But honey, then that's when something was revealed. Something was revealed because this emperor ended up with some type of ace of wands energy with some bumps that popped up. Child. Oh, my God. Yeah, this is. Mm -mm. And. So is this a reconciliation? So somebody want to come and reconcile? Who want to come and reconcile with somebody that's. So it could be a same sex lover that wants or somebody reconciled with a same sex lover. Because this is no reconciliation in the upright. In the reverse, it's no reconciliation. So, Or it's reconciliation. So somebody does not want to reconcile. This emperor does not want to reconcile. He's poured out his cups. He's looking at his thing, getting angry and getting mad. Because I don't know, honey. He's going through a tower, too. Ooh, honey. Ooh, shoot. Oh, I feel his pain right now. Like, his pain of his heart. Okay, this emperor, because his two of cups, okay, they were exposed. That's the truth, spirit say. Now they feel they they discover that their other half had other lovers, and so now they just like looking at things from a different perspective, or they're looking at their marriage from a different perspective. So what does that have to do with Jim? Jim and I, I don't think it has nothing to do with you. It's just I think your person. Well, I don't know how it fits, but this, this has to do with your inner circle. It could be somebody with your about your emperor or their emperor or one of your friend circle because the three of cups kept coming out and popping out with the the two of cups soulmate. So it could be a friend, a close friend, a best friend, a cousin, somebody you consider as family. Okay, something came out, was exposed about them and their marriage. But what does it have to do with Gemini High Vibe Cross Watcher? What does that have to do? This eight, this... Because somebody was... What does that have to do? Because the king of wands, some type of action that was taken. They invested in taking the leap of faith with, in a marriage. Queen of swords. And left out in the cold. They left you out in the cold for, I don't know, I don't know who this other person is that they left you for, this third party energy. I don't know how close you are, or if you even know this person, but they left you for this person. And this person is devastated and going through it right now because they're, they, they, that other person that they left you for left them. And then that person is devastated because this is too much. This is too much. And then that person is devastated because who they're, they're married to was dealing with your person, but they were married. Honey, child, he is angry and upset because he done got caught up with some bumpage or whatever the case may be. Child, and then somebody into the same sex, whatever, but then somebody want to come to this empress. Lord have mercy. Y'all, isn't it just that people need to heal? The world needs love and healing. And they need to go to God to do it. I don't know why they're not coming to God. Are they ashamed? Are they embarrassed about the situation? God, I already saw what was going on. You wasn't embarrassed when you thought nobody was watching and seeing. The angels was always around looking. Just looking and seeing what was going on, honey. That you seen you was being a wild one. And being in your shadow side. But now somebody's feeling some kind of way because... 
something's been exposed about them. And I don't know if they're worried about if you know that they've been exposed. Yeah, they, yeah, they're pissed off because they did not use their intuition because the whole time God, the ancestors, the angels was telling this person, don't do it. Don't do it. You're going to be mad as hell if you do. Like this person was trying to be slick and sly. They thought they was going to get away. They was being greedy. They was tr they was tr thinking they was going to receive good news going traveling to somebody because they, they like a lot of lovers. I mean, they want the attention. This is the attention whore that went wrong. Oh, my God. Yeah, because somebody was married. Somebody got left, got left hanging. They thought they was going to move on. <laughs> and they didn't get to move on. But now they feel in some kind of way wanting to run back to you. That's not how that works, ma'am or sir. That's weird. Especially when you're dealing with somebody intuitive is a high vibe collective. They already know everything. I don't know how you're going to mosey back up and talk about you done dropped your toxic ways and you done learned your lessons. and But you burning and popping and stuff. <laughs> That's not funny, but... And you trying to hide it. A heavy burden and everything. Sir or ma'am, please go to the doctor. Stop trying to come up in high vibes energy. Trying to... With this mess. Stop with this mess. You hear me? Go heal. Go to the doctor. Go get some rest. Do something. Child, I mean, because this don't even make no sense. Because you feel backstabbed and betrayed because Jim and I, I want to move on with their life. Let them move on with their life. You sitting here trying to hold on to something. Like, you're holding on to nothing. The more you try to hold on, the more that God is going to let you. Look, the more you hold on, you need to let go. Stop trying to strong arm somebody. Shit. Keep them near you or by you because you don't want them to move on. You don't want them to accept no other offers. You're just greedy and stingy. That's why you that's why you're in the situation that you got. And somebody's heavily burdened as well. Somebody was oh. I don't know. There's a wild there's some wild men's is out here, wild women's, however it go, honey. Somebody was low-key sleeping with somebody else's husband. I don't know. Maybe y'all was okay. I don't know. This is crazy. I, I, I gotta get out of here. Yeah, somebody was sleeping. Mm -hmm. Yep, and now somebody's getting a divorce and walking away from the whole situation. Yep. And walking to, towards you, Jim. I think that's why, because somebody want to walk. Gemini, I swear for God. Look, they want to... <gasps> There, it could be a Gemini now. It doesn't have to be, but it's somebody in that type of energy that can, I don't know, they want to work on things with you. They want to travel to you. They think it's your good news or this party like, this party likes, this person likes to party and drink a lot, but they see you as everything. They could be crying. I don't know. Something about you being wish fulfillment and they are doing some type of magic. And for some of y'all, the magic did backfire now. Because they trying to stop God's will. And you can't stop God's will. That's like stepping in front of a mat truck. Or a freight train. You know, he, like, boy or girl. <sighs> I, I'm just saying. People, mm, and somebody could be in a lot of, uh, they could be caught in a lot of conflict and chaos as well with the family. Somebody's family. Or Gemini, I don't know how this was working, but they could, the family, whoever this earth sign family member is they are angry that they didn't hold back from this person because it caused a whole lot of chaos and conflict why because now this earth sign is blocking whoever this other person is to get it uh, they leave it they left somebody on red what goes around comes around though i mean somebody thought oh wow well that i want to say don't take this person back though i don't think you ever will take them back i feel like this person disgusts you it doesn't matter if they've dropped their toxic ways. This person has left some type of PTSD on you or whatever. I don't feel like you can't heal through it, but you just ra you just rather not deal with it. That's what that is because you learned. This is some type of lesson that you learn with this Mercury. Yeah, you learned the lesson, so you just decide to go a whole not another way, a whole another direction, and you're gonna go in peace and harmony, and you're gonna have another lover. But somebody is walking away now because somebody is, um, mm, this person, they need to just go to the doctor because I don't see why they sitting here trying to think about, they thinking about being intimate with somebody or something or you or, 
Child, I don't even want... And they worried about this stuff having a breakout or a flare out. They were... Child, they worried about the wrong thing. How come somebody won't go heal? How come they don't want to go to the doctor? I just don't understand that part. And they still being promiscuous, giving up other people, possibly paying for prostitutes. Child, this is too much. Gemini, why is this... Gemini, let me get the tea like Spirit told me to do. Because I was going to end it because I couldn't take this energy no more, honey. What's the tea? What's this tea, spirit? Okay, I did shuffle a little bit. Or a lot of it before the video. But somebody's canceled or you canceled out somebody. Or somebody no longer exists to you, whoever this this person is. But you could be an emperor. Whoever you caught that gave you something, this person ain't existing to you no more. Because you didn't even really know this person, honey. They... They, they thought they, they tried to play you as a Ponzi scheme. Show sure did. Mm, with multiple, playing you with multiple lovers. Uh huh. What else, Holy Spirit? Let me do one more shuffle. Ooh, somebody was having flings and they was I'm telling you that's how they got that STD and exchange it for dirty money. So somebody was sleeping with prostitutes. It could have been this emperor sleeping with prostitutes and gave this queen of pentacles a disease. Okay. Oh, honey, it's either the prostitute is homeless or this person is, this Gemini is homeless, but that's their karma. They're stuck right now. They're waiting for their ships to come in. So now they're trying to drop their toxic ways because they're in a messed up predicament and they've been canceled. They've been canceled somewhere or you just sticking them to the side like they're a pest. Yeah. And what else, spirit? So, mm, some, oh, yeah, they did get sick. Somebody is also getting sick because they could be themselves that prosty, okay? Um, ooh, they're down bad, baby. Oh, my God, it is a Gemini. Gemini or Gemini, I don't know how you fit in there, baby. I know that's not my high vibe, but even if it's the low vibe, I'm praying for you. Oh, my God, they could be a leader of a cult or they could be in some type of a cult. Oh, they got in too deep about something, y'all. They got in too deep. About something. Hold on. They got in too deep. Okay. They feel like they're drowning. They're drowning. What else, spirit? And it looks like you don't even want to be with them or you're done with them. They, they, mm -mm. what else, spirit? So they feel like they've cursed themselves. Yeah. They've cursed themselves when they walked away from you or just because you walked away. Yeah. They feel that. And they could be jealous of your beauty or they walked away because someone else was jealous of your beauty. Maybe somebody that they were dealing with, the karmic energy was jealous of your beauty. But now they've counseled out and they've walked away from that karmic energy. Somebody's walking away. I heard two people are walking away from this karmic energy. Oh my gosh. Okay, because this karmic energy is unloyal. I mean, she's not loyal or he's not loyal. And this karmic energy could be salty right now, angry with you, bitter and ag agitated because they got left. They was messing with two people and ended up with none. And I don't know how y'all person feel or how you fit in there or whatever the case may be. But I feel like you're the main denominator of something. Okay. It's possibly that, oh, the other love. So this person was cheating on you. Okay. Or... Or they were cheating on you with that that third party energy. Mm hmm. What else, spirit? Mm hmm. What else? Oh wait, hold on. Let me grab that. I'm gonna grab that in a second. I just wanna. Okay, here. These two came out. Now somebody's getting ready to take some action with fail right here. Somebody's intimidated. So I don't know if somebody is homeless and intimidated. They're afraid to come up to you because they do need you. You antagonize them. But this is an active adversary. So they're gonna they're gonna act like they're very intimidated, very mild, very meek, very, you know, humble because they wanna take action towards you. Okay? They could be going through a divorce and all of that, but you've moved on from this energy. You don't want them anymore. And they feel like they've cursed themselves. This person could be a warlock or a witch. Take it however it resonates. But they feel like they could 
they want to rekindle because when I was going through these romance angel cards before the reading, it's like you freed yourself, but then they want to express their love because they still have chemistry for you and they want you to keep an open mind because they feel that you are their soulmate. You are the one. They want you to feel like this could be the one, but you feel like you want you need to love yourself first and you want to trust the process, but this person wants you to trust them, which you don't do, because they want to show up like, I'm, I'm new. I'm a new love. You could trust me, but this has always been unrequited, period. Your angels, because this person is extremely codependent on you and your energy or on finances or whatever the case may be. And they want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation to try to get you to open up, to make you feel like you're the one for me. You're my soulmate. Let's just get away. Let's just get to know each other and learn each other all over again because this person has a lot of romantic feelings for you still. But that doesn't mean that their intentions are good. They're calling you in. That's what they're trying to do. And you paid attention to the red flags and you let this person go. But they wanted you to know them again. They, 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 you're in, they want to get out of some type of separation. They want you to go into a retreat. Some of y'all could be going to a couple's, you know, you could be, I don't know. Maybe this person wants to go to counseling or go to a couple's healing retreat with you or take some time and get away. But I wouldn't go because Spirit said that retreat is a cult, okay? But anyway, they want to get to know you again. They could be, honey, yeah, but there's some type of deception involved, though. Yeah, Gemini, some type of a deception involved that you're separated from this person, but they want to get out of separation from you because you're busy minding your own business, not even sub-studying them. They want you to make the effort. They want you to come out of hiding. You know, they want to court you. They want to make it work again, but I don't see it working. I feel like they just too much healing needs to be done. Like the card said, this person is too codependent. And you've already freed yourself from this person. And the fact that this person is somewhat of a warlock and could be possibly doing black magic on you to call you back in. And they're going through a backfire. Man, yeah, you doing the right thing, Gemini, by staying away from this person. Yeah, this person thinks you're naive in love or you showing up as the queen of cups and stuff. And this temperance angel and... Don't let the smooth taste fool you because your love is just as great as your wrath, just like God. And they don't want to mess with that because you will turn your back and you have turned your back and you have moved on and you have laid this to rest, Gemini, period. But this person could be sick and need your help, though. They really could. Okay, now I don't know what to tell you on that one, but you're going to have to go with it on that one and see what God advises you to do because some things, you know, it's not that cut and dry what you should do you got to do what spirit is telling you to do okay so but you've already freed yourself from this person so i don't know it could be like just love them from a distance or spoon feed them from a distance or from a five foot spoon because you already know how this person is they're going through a tower but god you done moved on baby and there's no sense for you to turn around Absolutely not, because this person made bad decisions, because they chose the karmic in energy who was part of the devil's the devil's work. You know what I mean? They try to cause a tower for you to, oh, child, that's too much. So I just would, you just cleanse yourself from this energy. I mean, send them love and light, and you know, you have empathy, but you don't need to get sucked back into this vortex of bad luck with this person, because I feel like this person is some type of bad luck, or they have some type of entity attachment demon attachment they do they do something because they got some type of entity because they've been contacting the devil and the devil doesn't turn on them lord have mercy or the devil or the devil done turned on this earth sign child there was an illusion they thought they was powerful or they thought they could do some child there's rules to this i don't know why somebody they did it for money they did it for wealth they did it for status. They did it for fame. And also because somebody was jealous of you. So I don't know. It could be a lover or a friend or whoever was jealous of somebody. So all this was done out of jealousy, hate, and envy. But now somebody wants to come back to you because they messed up. And they're going through some type of tower. They could be ill right now, but you done moved away. And this person is very codependent on you. They need some type of help or assistance for you to take care of them. 
Oh, Lord, this is sad. It really is, because they're under judgment. So, like I said, oh, damn, they could be passing away, or there's some ending in their life. It could be a Scorpio. Let's just pray for them, honey. I don't know. There's nothing you can do. God's will be done. And there's nothing that anybody can do to get in front of that wheel of fortune. Because if you try, it will kill you. Okay? All right, then, Gemini. The spirit said the last words is, go ahead and free yourself. Okay? Go ahead and free yourself, Gemini, because you're free. It doesn't matter if you have a lot of chemistry because you've already expressed your emotions for this person. You, yeah, you've already been through the ringer with this person or been through cycles. And it's just time for you to go free yourself and live your life. And this is shocking to this person because they never thought in a million years that you would move on and leave them. But she did. You laid it to rest. And they're like, at the time that I need you the most, I need you, to mo I need you the most, you're leaving me while I'm sick. But Gemini, didn't they, Crosswatch or High Vibe, didn't they leave you at a time where you needed them the most? You could have been down and out on your finances and your emotions. You could have lost a loved one. You could have lost a job. You could have lost something. But you were always there emotionally for this person and they weren't even there for you. But now that God has shown you a sudden revelation about what's really going on and how this person really operate you moving on and they mad about it that's weird as hell because they're going through things and losing things and they want they need they child they need to be self-sufficient and independent like you okay whoever you are you are self-sufficient and independent and you know you're not codependent you get it you get it on your own and you get it through the mud whoever you are and somebody's pissed off that you do that because they don't have, and you canceled this energy from your life, and they mad about that. Man, if they don't go somewhere and take a long nap for eternity, and we're going to pray for them as well, okay? But to be in that energy, like, who wants that around? Like, my God, just go rest for eternity. You don't even have to wake up, like, in love and light, though. I'm not trying to be funny or mean or nothing. It's just these energies get on everybody's nerves. They do. You free. They curse themselves and they want to still drag you down and, and blame you and get mad at you because you done moved on and they sick. <sighs> that reminds me of that diary of a mad black woman with that Helen and that member that that a-hole husband of hers. And he moved a whole nother karmic energy in and was clowning her and teasing her. And when she came home... He had all her stuff out in the front lawn or front yard or whatever and moved all her stuff out and moved the mistress shit in her, in her house. Okay, mistreated her. Man, that's like that energy. Mm -mm, Gemini, you done freed yourself. Now, you can help him if you want to. I mean, that's fine. I don't know. I don't want to tell you not to or what to do. That's between you and the father. Only you can use your intuition because everybody's path is different. But most of these narcissistic energies, God is putting his foot on their neck. He's not get, He's not letting up easy. Even though they like, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. God was like, you were, because I feel like this person been doing this. And they went to the limit or they did too much or they did something forbidden or something that they didn't have to do. They did unnecessarily. And so God is like, yeah, okay, you can't, you try to cancel my baby, I'm going to cancel your ass. So now they need you, baby. And God is like, mm -mm, you better not. <laughs> Dang, Gemini, you feel it in your soul. God said you you, div you divorced this person spiritually. It was a dissolution of a marriage, okay? Because this person, they cursed themselves. It was null and void. This is a dissolution of a marriage contract. Whatever you had in the ethers, honey... You were able to free. God signed it. The judge signed your contract and you became a free man or a free woman. And this person ended up cursing themselves. So now that you're free, why the hell? Because they're having some type of weird tower that you got to run back into the fire and try to rescue them. No, that's their karma. Okay. And that's for them to deal with. Because God wants you to be happy. Like he knows you got love in your heart and everything. You done tried with this person, but... It comes a time where just let God do the work. Stop trying to save everybody because we can't save ourselves. But God, the Holy Spirit in us, that's our only hope of salvation and our only hope of glory. So this person needs to go to God, okay? Your mind's on God. Your focus is on God. So this person needs to be on God too. Okay, Gemini? 
All right, baby, I love you so much, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.